All right, we're gonna look at G Style. It's kind of an old program, but I said I would look at it. Um, so let's do this here. G Style is a uh, theme manager for your GNOME system. So basically, they have different tabs here, and we just can go in order. The first one is full themes, and this is where you can do like customizing, you know, your GTK or your icon themes. You can mix and match. Like these are the buttons, how it look like. They give you a little preview, so you know what it's gonna look like. Same thing with the icons, right? Not a big deal. And that's the elements. Let's go to the downloads. Um, let's do a refresh here. And they give you uh, most of these are the Biziki themes, which I talked about in the past. But they do have some other ones like the Mac themes, Bleach, and some of these other ones, school papers. I don't know. But these are full themes, so they comes with like a. a uh, a, a uh, wallpaper, uh, GDM themes, icon packs, uh, you know, all of that. So it's full themes. That's why it's in here. All I gotta do is download it and you know, I'll install it. And uh, the GTK themes, they give you a little preview of how it looks like. So you go like this, and you just select your, you know, your GTK themes. If I wanted dust, this is how dust will look like, and maybe. And all you gotta do is apply it, right? That's it. Otherwise, if you download it like from GNOME Look or something, you can just add it from here, uh, you know, after you download it. But let's go to the next one the icon themes. You know, pretty obvious. Just select the icons that you want to use and just apply it. Other options here. Um, <clears throat> This is the GNOME panel icon. So basically, is this icon up here? If you want to change it, you can change it. Uh, some of these other ones are like you know, GCon uh, tweaks. So I'm give you an example. Um, if you want your home, you know, icon to be visible, there you go. Trash, blah blah blah. You get the idea, right? Uh, this menu has I have icons here. It's basically you know how your menus here they have all the icons for the other ones except for down here it says places and systems nothing right and here in the preference nothing but if you enable that now you have all the icons there you go that's some of the tweaks not really that important and let's go on to the next one wallpapers uh... you can do this with you know your normal one already but they do have it in here if you want to select the wallpapers you want to use uh, this tab here, I'm not really sure, but it has to do with, uh, I guess, dynamic wallpaper. So change it over time. I don't really have time to play around with it. And then we go to the next one, the Windows Decorator, or I mean the Windows Decoration here. Um, basically, this is your your title bar. So you see that your title bar is this part up here, right? And sometimes the whole border around it too, but for this one it's just the title bar uh, you see how it looks different if you apply different themes that's it, that's basically it they do have emerald with this uh, you can actually manage your emerald in here but um, if you don't know what emerald is I have a video on that like in the past if you want to go and watch that because that's uh, you know another thing here but uh, <clears throat> let's sum it up what emerald is, it's basically a uh, you know, it's just like a, a theme manager for your uh, your your title bar and all that. It'll make it look like you know KDE or the Windows Arrow or whatever it is that themes that they have, uh, or even the Mac one too, if you want to do that. And basically, that's Emerald. Anyways, you want to learn more about that? Just watch my video on Emerald. Uh, that's it for that one. The mouse themes. Basically, you, you select the mouse themes that you want. If you want more mouse themes, just go to gnomelook.org and they'll give you more mouse themes. Um, that's it. Just select the one you want and hit apply. Basically, that's all you got to do here. GDM themes, this is where your login screen is. Let me just type in my password so you can see uh, what's in here. Alright, so this is where, uh, you know, when you log in and they give you like a I think the the purple theme for uh, Ubuntu, but you can change it to whatever you want. You know, you, whatever in here. Uh, the icons, even the background of it, if you like. Um, that's basically what you're doing here. You want to play sounds or not? Um, you 
want you can disable it and what does it say synchronize uh, your G GDM themes or your GDM with your current theme so if you want to use this one uh, I believe it's just gonna sync it you know whatever you change on your your um, your current system uh, it's gonna change that with the GDM themes if you want to not really necessary and then you go to this thing called the cube models this is actually kinda different from uh, the other managers I talked about in the past they have this thing I actually haven't installed it because it's actually really old now and is in French so I didn't want to try it but the, basically if you use if you see my uh, cube, cube Atlantis videos you know the one with the compares and shit they had like fishes well this one has like other themes like dinosaurs and airplanes or whatever that's basically what they do uh, with this thing here so it's not really that important because it looks stupid anyways and I think that's it for this one G style and you can go to the website if you wanna uh, maybe try out a new version but uh, would I recommend anyone use this? no not really it's uh, I don't really see anything that's uh, promising with this you know so anyways that's uh, G style if you wanna go and install it uh, go ahead <laughs> alright that's it for this one.